because we need to get air for the tires and go get the damn inspection sticker. What's wrong? Fucking thing is off. It's not even on. Uh. Hey guys, so we dropped Aiden at school for his first day this morning. He was, we've been doing like a countdown on the whiteboard in the kitchen so that he kind of like knew that which day school was coming on. So he wasn't too upset. I have a funny picture of him with his little first day of school board. And he's like got the bottom lip because he's about to cry. But he was fine once we got there. And then he, he like looked at me and was like, first school, then McDonald's, all serious. <laughs> he's like, he wants McDonald's when he gets out of school. I don't know why my hair is so frizzy. I just washed it last night and like, no matter what I put in it anymore, nothing helps the frizziness um my last vlog was totally like my lips weren't synced up the audio was not synced up with the video and i think i figured out why it does that sometimes if whatever i'm recording is over 10 minutes long for some reason the like my voice does not sync up with the video so I don't know why it does that. I have plenty of room on my phone because I had gone through, I got rid of all the extra videos and pictures and everything on there that were on my phone. So like it's not that my phone doesn't have enough memory or space or anything, so I don't know why it's doing that. I'm definitely not getting a new phone because this one's not even paid off yet. Um, what else do I have for updates today? I don't know, I have to, I'm so tired. I gotta get back in this, in the, uh, swing of things here. Because we hadn't been getting up that early. Uh, we have to get up for, like, at least 7.30 to be on time for school. Well, to give me enough time to, like, finish packing his lunch and everything and get him dressed. Um, but I have some videos I need to record today. Um, I'm gonna record a video about, like, my Pretties for Your Face fall stuff. Because I haven't done a shop update video in so long. And I have my craft palette. It's called We Are the Weirdos, Mister. And I haven't shown this at all actually on my Instagram yet at the time that I'm filming this. But I'm hoping to release it within the next week or so. This is what it looks like. And I'll show you the colors inside. I wanted it to be obviously like dark gothic-y colors but to also have some light ones in there so there's no completely matte shades in this palette I did that on purpose this one is almost matte but it's like a copper shade this one's really pretty it's like a very light rosy pink with strong turquoise shift to it and this is like a metallic purpley mauve and then this is a violet 
and this is a black with golden green micro shimmer in it. So that is the first look at that. But I'm going to do a whole video on this with swatches and show some of the other stuff that I made. I still have my cough, but like yesterday was the first day I finally felt like it was going away. And then I kept having coughing fits in the middle of the night because my throat is still all tickly. It's like, it feels like someone's tickling the inside of my throat all the time. Um, but my eyeshadow is like not staying on today because my eyes are super watery. Such a pain in the butt. Anyway, I don't really have anything else to update. We went to fill... <coughs> we went to fill the car's tires with air and then we went to go get a... Uh, the car needs an inspection sticker and an oil change and we went to go do that at Midas but they couldn't do it for us today because their uh, machine isn't working to do the inspection sticker and they're waiting for the technician to come fix it um, so Steven starts tomorrow and he works Thursday but he has Friday off so we're gonna try to go back Friday and if not I'm gonna have to just take his car one day and go get that done um, I don't know why they couldn't do the oil change though like, you don't need a machine other than the lift to do the oil change. I don't know. <sighs> anyway. We'll get done sooner or later. It's not at the point where it, like, desperately needs an oil change yet, so that's good. But, um, and then I took, we cleaned the Jeep the other day, and friggin' it was yesterday, we took it through the car wash, and then it friggin' rained last night, and we had thunderstorms. That, it never fails that that always happens when I wash one of the cars. Um, anyway, I have work to do and I have to film videos. So that's all I'm up to today until it's time to go get Aiden. So I will talk to you guys later on. Hey guys, I'm going to do a quick like little video while I'm getting ready for the day. Today is uh, Wednesday. <laughs> I hate when I have to think about what day it is. I'm so lost this morning because Steven just went to work and he's been home for a few weeks. So I gotta get used to being by myself today because he was home for a few weeks, Aiden was home all summer, and now I'm gonna be alone. So I think what I'm gonna do today is do like some Halloween hunting. Um, I'm go I have to go to Target anyway because I need to get new um like bath rugs for the downstairs bathroom because i had to wash them the other day and they're, now they're all falling apart but i have had them for several years they were um like day of the dead skull rugs that i got from kohl's like five years ago so for them to last that long was pretty good especially the uh the one outside of the shower because that one gets soaking wet all the time. Um, so I'm gonna go to Target because their Halloween stuff is supposedly out. I hope it is because last year they took a really long time to get their stuff out. Them and Walmart were the last places around here to put their Halloween stuff out. I went to Spirit the other day with my brother and I forgot to like bring my phone with me so I could film anything because we visited my grandma on Sunday and then Aiden didn't want to go so he stayed with my grandma and my brother and I went to Spirit but I don't know I didn't I wasn't too impressed with it this year they usually have a lot of animatronics set up and they they didn't have that big setup like they usually do they had like a pirate ship looking thing with the stupid hug hugging clown in it like, why they put that in a pirate ship, I have no idea. But that was the thing that Aiden liked last year. He wanted to hug it. I have a picture of him smiling in front of it. Um, I know there is a Halloween store in the mall. They usually put one there in one of the big empty stores, but it's not a spirit Halloween. And I, I never really liked that place because it's, it's basically all costumes there's not a lot of like home decor and um any of the fun animatronic stuff or any of that it's basically all costumes the one that's in the mall so 
I will go in there and take a look next time I go, but I was supposed to go tomorrow with my friend. We were going to meet up today, but her husband needed their car, so. Um, I am using the ColourPop X's and O's palette, which is apparently an Ulta exclusive because I can't, I don't see it anywhere else that sells ColourPop. Um, I don't know why my nose is all stuffy today. I don't even know what I'm going to do with it, so I guess I'm going to do like a rusty look. I, I filmed, oh no, that's the wrong one, right? I filmed the video with, uh, the swatch video for this yesterday, so... Don't know which video will be up sooner, this one or that one. I don't like this first color, it's way too sheer. I think it's meant to be more of like a glittery topper than anything else. I actually just got the email that they shipped his little, uh, what do they call it, like the holiday package. I get him the, uh, what is it called, the Dr. Seuss and Friends book club subscription, which is, if you go to earlymoments.com, they have a whole bunch of different, um, like book subscriptions for kids. So he gets three books every month, and then... I think it's quarterly they send you a package like a holiday package and the one that they send out around this time of year has a calendar in it so he's gotten that for the past two years and it's a dr seuss calendar and he loves it but i usually uh take it and then hide it and wrap it up for christmas and then he gets it on christmas because otherwise he would want to hang up a 2020 calendar right now and it's not time to hang it up yet I got this mascara uh, it's essence lashes hashtag lashes of the day and this is like my new favorite mascara it's really like it grabs onto your lashes and it curls them which is what I always look for in a mascara because I already have pretty long lashes, so I don't need like a length lengthening one. The only thing with it is if you do if you keep going over it with coats, it's gonna start getting like that spidery look, which I don't like. But I tend to just do a little coat of mascara anyway. Okay, but now I gotta go get him ready, so I kind of just wanted to sit and chit-chat so I don't have to do it in the car after, because I have a bunch of different places to go. I'm gonna go to Michael's first, and I'm gonna check out TJ Maxx to see if they put any more Halloween stuff out. I'm gonna go over to Target. I might go into Ulta because Steven wants beard stuff, and I'm pretty sure they have it in there. I know they have it online. But anyway, I will talk to you guys later on. So, uh, it's still Wednesday, actually. I just wanted to update because <laughs> Steven came home because he's not taking that job, and I don't blame him. Um, he went there this morning, and once again, this job was not what it was supposed to be. He got there, and it was like, he thought that he was being like a maintenance person for the hospital area of the prison and apparently this prison is way bigger than we ever thought it was because like you can't go driving down there it's like a maximum security prison so all we ever saw was like the prison yard if we drove down there like it's not a pl it's not in an area where you can drive by it and look at it it's like down this little uh dirt road with woods on both sides and then like you see the prison and you can't go any farther than that you gotta turn around and come back but it like goes on and on and the 
building that he was supposed to be working in was way bigger than what they explained. And it is not just like a prison hospital, it is where it's a separate building where they house all the criminally insane people that can't be in like general population because they have diseases like hepatitis C and AIDS and all that shit and they're explaining to him that he was like gonna have to clean their shit when they write on the walls with it and stuff and he's like whoa <laughs> like that was not explained because if that was explained he would have never been like yeah I'll take, take this job but it was like he brought his cigarettes in, in with him like an idiot I was like why did you do that and the guy like the guard shoved him against the wall and like brutally frisked him because he's like why are you bringing cigarettes and a lighter in here so like when the lady was explaining all the everything to him and like you got to stay in that building you cannot leave when you take your break and yada 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 he was just like yeah i'm not doing this so his friend that i think i've mentioned before they worked together at the last two jobs uh he I forgot what place I have to actually fill out the application for him. I want to say it was like, Ch was it Chiquita? Chiquita Banana? Yeah, Chiquita Fresh North America. He's like the manager there now, so he's gonna try and get him a job there. But it just sucks because like this place is farther away again. <sighs> but the thing is, like this. If he had taken this job, I would have been freaking worried about him constantly. I would The fact that they were telling him, oh, you're good. Like, I mentioned to you guys that he needed to have Timberland boots, right? That I had, I've already ordered and paid a hundred bucks for these freaking boots that now he's probably never going to wear because he doesn't like black boots. I'm going to have to see if I can return them. Um, they told him he's going to need like three or four pairs because if he gets shit on them, he's not gonna wanna walk around all day with shit on his boots. And I'm like, so you're supposed to just ruin $100 boots all the time? Cause I'm not fucking cleaning boots that have hepatitis people shit on it. Um, and like the same with pants and stuff, like they expect you to bring, uh, what do you call it? Infected feces covered clothing home to like your family and wash them in your freaking washer and dryer then just no I would have told him if he had worked the whole day and come home and told me that I would have been like nope let's find something else because <laughs> I ain't doing that um yeah I, it's uh Chiquita Banana is this place so that was the one job that I found on uh, Craigslist, this cleaning job that he was going to, the maintenance worker position. So I'm not looking for anything else on, on Craigslist, forget that. Everything else that I found on there was just like stupid little temporary jobs. So I'm gonna stick to Indeed and apply him for like whatever else we can find on here, just in case this Chiquita place doesn't work out, but... <sighs> Anyway, I just wanted to update you guys on that. He's bummed about it because he wanted it to work out, obviously. For it to be like an eight minute drive from here to that place was awesome, but the, the job itself, no, no. Um, so hopefully something works out within the next week or two and he can go work with his friend again, but been a rough morning so far so I went to Michael's I got uh, I had a 50% off coupon but it was only 50% off one regular priced item and everything that I needed to go in there for was on sale so I didn't get anything but like a little squishy toy for Aiden um, and then I went into Target and they do not have their Halloween stuff out yet. They don't even have the stuff in the like the dollar spot. They have a few Halloween things in the dollar spot and that was all they had. I think they're starting to get ready to put the Halloween stuff out because they they were taking down back to school stuff. But I swear, this Target is the slowest at putting out Halloween stuff every year. I should have known that too because um, last year they were really late putting Halloween stuff out. But I 
uh, I have the Target app, obviously, and I was making my list on it last night for the stuff that I needed. And I really want to try the M&M's with the Cocoa Krispies in them this year. They're like the Halloween exclusive one. And it said they were in stock in my store. So they must have them. They're just in the back and nobody's put Halloween stuff out yet. Which is a bummer because I keep seeing people on Instagram go to Target and stuff and all their Halloween stuff is out. So ours just sucks. But I gotta see how much work I can get done before I have to go get Aiden. So I'll talk to you guys later on. So I picked up these sneakers for Aiden today at Target. You love watching to move. Yes. <laughs> He's in a size one, right? So it says one on the box. Then the friggin' inside says 13. And I was like, oh crap, are they in the wrong box? But then it says one on the tongue, and it says one on the bottom. So I, I don't know, they must have printed the wrong size in there. They fit them, which I guess that that's what counts, but it just scared me for a minute because I'm like, oh crap, they didn't have any other sizes. This was like the last pair of these red ones, and he loves red sneakers. So, I got him these because I had bought a pair from um, Children's Place, and when they came, they didn't look like they did on the website, and they're kind of ugly, <laughs> and I don't think, I mean, they're not really bothering him, but they'll just be like his play shoes because I don't like them, Steven doesn't like them, so these are going to be his good school shoes. I haven't done anything with my hair yet, so ignore that. And if you can hear the shower running, it's because Steven's in the shower, but I just wanted to do like an update video this morning while I was getting ready. I'm already halfway done, but, um, what am I doing today? Today I have to go grocery shopping, and Steven has to go try to get the inspection sticker and the oil change for the car. Um... I think that's it. I do, I want to run back to TJ Maxx because yesterday I found a witch that I know my grandma will love. Um, I explain this all the time, but if you haven't, like, if this is the first video of mine you're watching for some reason, my grandma collects witches for Halloween, and every year since I was, like, 16, I've been getting her, a, like, I find a little witch, or a big witch, to give her for Halloween. So... I usually get them from Marshalls or TJ Maxx because they always have super unique looking ones every year. And when I was in TJ Maxx yesterday, there was, well, they had two of them. So I'm hoping when I go back, they still have it. I regretted not getting it yesterday so hard that I got to go back and get it. But it's like the size of me. <laughs> and it is, I don't know where she's going to put it, but I think it will like, outdo all the other ones I've ever found for her and she never like goes to TJ Maxx or anything so she has not seen that yet I know she hasn't because if she saw it she would have bought it herself it was 40 bucks which is not bad for how big it is because I've spent 40 bucks on them for her before that were way smaller than that um luckily my cough it's pretty much gone. It's not like, it's not bothering me anymore. Now it's more of like, when I eat or if something aggravates my throat, then it'll cause like a miniature coughing fit, but nothing like what I was having. Oh my gosh. There was like three nights where I got hardly any sleep at all. Which sucked at the beginning of the week because I had to get up super, like way earlier than normal because of Aiden going to school. But last night and the night before were the first nights in a, like two weeks now <laughs> that I've been able to sleep all the way through the night without getting up having coughing fits. So, plus I went to bed earlier last night because I've been freaking. I was so tired this week. <sighs> um. I think that's pretty much it for updates though. I tried to like not do a bunch of car updates this week because whenever I do that, they're too long and then the audio does not sync up with the video. 
I did get these at TJ Maxx yesterday from my grandma because it looks like Izzy. They only had one of these. It's a set of two, but the dog design is only on one. So it's like you use this one as decoration and then that one to actually dry your dishes. Yeah. Um, my best friend when I saw her yesterday, she got me this mold for Halloween. Super cute. It's like, it's bats and cats and pumpkins. So I can make some new soaps. These are my Halloween Sanderson Sisters bath bombs and book bubble bars. These are brown sugar and fig scent. And then these are Victoria's Secret bombshell scent. All, all three of them are the same. And my friend also got me this hilarious cookbook. It's so funny. What the fuck should I make for dinner? And like everything inside is just equally as vulgar. So like, let's see. Oh, food coma. <laughs> you, love, you love shapes. You love shapes. <laughs> so funny. Anyway, she gave me this stuff because I hadn't seen her from my birthday. That's how long it's been since I've seen her, so that was my birthday present. But, um, yeah, this is my Halloween bath stuff. Actually, a lot of these cracked, so they're going to be clearance, and I have to make new ones this weekend. But everything's going up this weekend, so by the time you see this, it'll all be up on the website. The eyeshadow palette, the pressed highlighter, liquid highlighter, black lip balm, black lip scrub, and this stuff. So, go order some. 